Okay, so today I wanted to do a what's in my bag video and I will be using my purse. This is like my everyday purse. I believe I got this at Peebles like a year ago. I mean, so it's kind of old, but I don't know. I still like it. And I got this purse at Peebles for a, like a year ago. I think it was like 60 bucks. Um, it's just sort of like plain brown. Yeah, and it's got two pockets on the front. And then it has another pocket on the back. I don't know if you can see that because the handles are in the way. But it's got another pocket in the back here. And then it's got like, and then inside it has like all my crap. And then it's got like a middle inside pocket here. Yeah. Alright, so I guess I'll start on the outside pocket. I don't keep anything in these two pockets usually. Sometimes I might put my phone there, but I usually don't. On this outside pocket, I have, I don't even know what's in here. Um, I have the spare key to my car, and then I have, like, a bunch of random business cards. Like, this one says I have a dentist appointment in January, um, and then I have other just random business cards. Like, actually, this one's not even a business card. This is the coach care instructions little booklet. I just keep random business cards apparently in there along with the spare key to my car. So I guess we'll move on to the inside of my purse. Awesome. Okay, so I'm going to go through this little, like, inside my bag, there's like a little, um, this is a pretty large bag, by the way, which is one of the reasons I like it, because when you're in college, bigger bags are sometimes good, but sometimes they can be bad, but I usually like this one as like my everyday sort of bag while I'm here. When I'm home, I sometimes switch it up every few days, but yeah seeing as how I'm not home, there's not much I can do about that. Okay, so first off in my bag, I have my keys. I have this little, like, it's a Vera, ba uh, Vera Bradley thing, and it has my car key, uh, my house key to my house at home, and then it's got my dorm key. And it's got this, and inside I keep, like, sometimes spare change, but, like, my license, my school ID, my social security number's in here. Just important information. Like, I keep my debit card in here and my credit cards in here as well. I usually don't keep them in my wallet because it's easier for me to get to them when they're in here. And then I also have my phone. Okay, so now on to that, like, the rest of whatever's in this smaller pocket. It's little, like, this little inside zippered pocket right here. I have the Pixie Tinted Brilliance Balm in number 6, Baby Bear. I believe this was in, like, one of my recent favorites video. I'm pretty sure it is. Okay. And then I have my, one of, this is one of my uh, Bath and Body Works lip glosses. And this is the Paris Amour one. And this one does not ever leave my purse. This is, like, the one lip gloss I always keep in my purse, even though there's, like, a ton of other ones in here. I always just keep this one in. I have a hair clip. These are always handy. I have a ton of bobby pins. Like, I don't know. So you have a lot of bobby pins. I guess you just never know when you're going to need some. You're, you guys are probably going to think I'm like a hoarder after this video. <laughs> um, I have some spare change. I have three quarters. Okay. I have this little uh, Oscar de la Renta little sample perfume. I have that. Um, sometimes, like, if I get sample perfumes, I'll try and, like, I just sort of throw one of them into my purse, so that way, I don't know, in case you ever need, like, a little perfume, you have it. So, this is the Oscar de la Renta one. It smells really nice, by the way. And then I have a cough drop, because I was, like, sick not too long ago, so I have a cough drop. And then I have this little, like, cover girl pressed powder thing and you can tell this is like crazy old I don't even use it anymore but I use it just for the mirror like there's powder in here but I haven't used it in forever I just use it for the mirror so that's that yeah this this thing right here probably makes me look like a hoarder but whatever alright that's it that's in this little smaller pocket so as I told you before, there's this pocket which kind of separates the purse into two. So, I guess I'll go through what's in this more full section over here. Alright, there's like a ton of stuff in here. Okay. First, I have 
a Chipotle receipt. That can get thrown away. And then I have this little thing from American Eagle. It's a 15% off coupon because I'm going home this weekend. So I'll probably be able to use this because it expires on the 20th of November. So I'll probably be using this this weekend. And then I have my wallet. This is my wallet. It's got like the inside looks like this. Can't really get any information from here, so don't mind showing you this. It's got this. It's got like little pockets here for like little cards. My checkbook I keep in here. So yeah. That's my wallet, and it's, my wallet's a coach wallet, it's pink, it looks like this, and it's got like a big change pocket on the back here, so yeah, that's my wallet, in case you were wondering. I have a general admission ticket, because for my high school, or my high school, my college's theater department, I'm actually wearing a shirt from them right now, because I had a basketball game last night, so supporting my school. Um, and this was for the 25th annual Putnam County Spelling Bee. That was the play. My high or Why do I keep saying my high school? Oh my goodness. Um, that was the play that my university's theater department did. And it was November 7th. November 8th at 7 p.m. And it's this weekend also. And I went because my roommate is in it. So I have a theater ticket for that. I have a business card in here for the Reston Apple Store in Reston, Virginia. I don't know why I have that. I have a pen from Sunchase. Um, it's like this apartment community thing. It's, all, it's actually where I'll be living next year because I just signed my lease today. Yay! It's awesome. I'm going to live in an apartment. Yay. Okay. And then I have, like, this little thing. It has keys to, like, a lock I have that was supposed to be for my closet, but I don't use it ever, so I just have the keys down here. And then I have this little keychain that says 2011, because that's the year I graduated high school. And then I have, like, my library card for back home. I have one of those, like, American Eagle all access passes and you can tell this one's really old because they've changed so much I have one of the first like all access passes. I think I got this when I was like maybe 12 or 13 so I've had this a long time and then I have a hot topic thing this is like all my little bonus points cards like I have one from Kroger and let's see Dick's Sporting Goods there's one for Bloom, and then there's one for Borders, which went out of business. See, there's one for Borders, which went out of business, so I guess I could throw that one away. Then I have, like, a Panera one. And then I have one for Wegmans. Like, I don't know if you guys know what Wegmans is, but it's like a Jewish grocery store. I'm not Jewish, but it's still a really cool grocery store. And then I have my library card for... Cause this is my library card for where my college is located. It's not for my school, but like it's for the county library here. I just figured I should get one just in case. You never know. So yeah, I have that. And then I have a ton of stuff in here. Okay. Let's see. I have another bobby pin. I have Bath and Body Works Midnight Pomegranate Hand Sanitizer. I always keep hand sanitizer in my bags, no matter what. You never know when you're going to need it. And then I have another lip gloss. This one is the L'Oreal Paris Color Rich Le Gloss in Raspberry Splash. Looks like that. And then I have a Victoria's Secret lip gloss in Intimate. Looks like that. And then I have an e.l.f. lip gloss, an e.l.f. Hyper Shine gloss, excuse me, in Flirt. I've used this one a lot. Um, another L'Oreal Color Rich Gloss, and this one's in Nude Touch, it's like that. And then I have another lip gloss, um, Revlon Lip Gloss in Pink Whisper. 
Looky here, um, Revlon Just Fit and Kissable Balm Stain in Honey. I'm actually wearing this one right now. And then I have my Burt's Bees Chapstick. And then I have a pencil, because they're always handy. I have a pen also, because you never know if you're going to need a pen or a pencil. Because you always sign things in pen. You never sign in pencil. And then I have my Eco Tools Kabuki brush, and it looks like this. And this thing is good for traveling, because it's got, like, the little case, or the little thing over it. So you can just, like, put it in your purse and go. That's why I like this one, so I do keep it in my purse. And then... I also have this little, like, ankle bracelet thing that I got at the beach this summer. I don't know why it's in my purse, but it is. So that's all that's in the big pocket. And then this slightly smaller pocket only has a little bit in it, so I'm going to be quick with this. I have another little mini hair clip. And then I have my sunglasses. They look like this. They're from Nordstrom. I'm going to click that from the side. I don't know if you can... It's got, like, gold detailing there. And I like them. They're nice and big, and they look like this. I have a hair tie. You never know when you're going to need a hair tie. And then I have my iPod. Looks like this. It's the 160GB black classic. Holds a lot of music. I keep this in my purse because... I use it in my car. I don't know. I just I can't listen to radio commercials. I hate them. So I keep updating my and I keep it in my purse so that way I can like bring it back and forth between my car and here, like my computer easily. Like this thing's also pretty old. I've had it for a few years. And then last but not least, I have a headband. Cuz I don't know. I guess it's sort of like the hair tie. You never know. It's just like a plain black stretchy headband kind of looks like that. You never know when you're going to need one. So that is everything that's in my bag. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, this random video that shows that I am a lip gloss hoarder. And um, please feel free to like leave a video response and go through whatever's in your bag because we're girls and we have lots of stuff. I know I do. And everything in my bag, I don't know, it had a reason for being there at one point but it just doesn't anymore. Maybe this is good. It's like therapy, cleaning out my purse in front of a camera. Awesome. Please leave a video response of you guys going through your stuff. I don't know. Is that weird? I don't know. But anyways, yeah, so um, if you guys have any suggestions of videos you would like me to do, anything you would like me to like review or anything, please like leave a suggestion in a comment below or... I don't know, like, message me. And then you can also find me on Twitter at twitter.com slash Sarah Marie Says and on Tumblr at uh, loveglitterandhappiness.tumblr.com and then I'm also on Pinterest at pinterest.com slash Sarah Donahue. Alright, have fun. Bye, guys.